This is an example of the heater bakeout function. The nominal load current for this load is 4 amps. We have set the overcurrent trip at 6 amps. If the load current exceeds this trip point, the output shuts off and trips a heater bakeout error. The bakeout time is set for one minute. Once the bakeout function is configured, cycling the control power initiates the bakeout function. The power series uses phase angle firing to increase the voltage applied to the load at a rate defined by the bakeout time. The load current is compared to the overcurrent trip value as the voltage is increased. If the current hits the overcurrent trip, the output turns off and displays a heater bakeout error. The heater is still too wet. The bakeout time must be increased and another bakeout cycle initiated by cycling control power. If the heater bakeout cycle is successful, the power series switches to the firing mode programmed by the user. Heater bakeout uses phase angle firing until the bakeout time expires and then in this example switches to variable time based zero cross firing. 